MLB Pipeline rolled out its Cubs Top 30 Prospects list on Thursday. While most of these players aren't household names, at least yet, let's take the time to learn some things about them. MLB Pipeline releases Cubs Top 30 Prospects list originally appeared on NBC Sports Chicago.com each year, MLB Pipeline rolls out its top prospect lists, featuring an overall top 100 and a top 30 by team. The Cubs Top 30 list was released Thursday, 18 of the players were drafted, while 12 were international signings. The group features 17 pitchers and 13 position players ranging in age from 17 to 25 and in height from 5 foot 8 to 6 foot 7. Most of these players aren't household names, at least yet, so let's take the time to learn some things about them. 1. Miguel Amaya, catcher Amaya, ranked as the Cubs' top prospect by MLB Pipeline, has also made the cut on a few overall top 100 prospect lists. Number 94 on MLB Pipeline's Top 100 Prospects Number 91 on Keith Law's ESPN List of Top 100 Prospects No. 89 on John Sickles' The Athletic List of Top 100 Prospects No. 73 on Fangraph's List of Top 100 Prospects Amaya just missed the cut on the Baseball America and Baseball Prospectus lists. He's MLB Pipeline's seventh-ranked catching prospect and he's the youngest receiver of the catching top 10, he turns 20 on March 9.2. Nico Horner, shortstop the Stanford product is no. 100 on MLB Pipeline's top 100 prospects. Since Pipeline went from a top 50 to a top 100 list in 2012, here are the preseason number 100 ranked prospects by year. 2012 Addison Reed, right-handed pitcher, White Sox 2013 Gary Brown, outfielder. Giants 2014 Pierce Johnson, right-handed pitcher, Cubs 2015 Stephen Moya, outfielder, Tigers 2016 Matt Olson, first baseman, Athletics 2017 Matt Chapman, third baseman, shortstop, Athletics 2018 Riley Pine, right-handed pitcher, Rockies 2019 Nico Horner, shortstop, Cubs 3. Braylon Marquez, left-handed pitcher as Marquez is the Cubs' top-ranked pitching prospect. Here are the preseason Cubs' top-ranked pitching prospects via MLB Pipeline. Since 2011 to 2011 Chris Carpenter, right-handed pitcher 2012 Aradis Vizcaino, right-handed pitcher 2013 Aradis Vizcaino, right-handed pitcher 2014. Carl Edwards Jr., right-handed pitcher 2015 Carl Edwards Jr., right-handed pitcher 2016 Dylan Cease, right-handed pitcher 2017 Oscar De La Cruz, right-handed pitcher 2018 Adbert Azale, right-handed pitcher 2019 Braylon Marquez, left-handed pitcher all righties until you get to Marquez.4. Adbert Azale, right-handed pitcher Azale's signing bonus out of Venezuela was only $10,000, less than the $2 million given to another prospect with the same initials, Aramis Adaman, whose name appears a few spots below. By the way, the only pitcher in Cubs history with initials AA is Antonio Alfonseca. Azale will likely be the second and possibly the first to start a game. Our Tony Andraki has you covered on Azale here, 5. Cole Roderer, outfielder Roderer is one of three Cubs drafted in the second round of the 2018 draft, Brennan Davis, 62nd overall, Roderer, 77th overall, and Paul Richin, 78th overall. Roderer and Richin, selected with back-to-back -back draft picks, I attended the same high school, Hart High School in Santa Clarita, Calif. In 36 games in the Arizona League in 2018, Roderer had four doubles, four triples, and five home runs. Point six. Aramis Adaman, shortstop MLB career home run leaders with first name Aramis, 386 Aramis Ramirez 4 Aramis Garcia 7. Bren Davis, outfielder named Premier Region Defensive Player of the Year playing basketball for Basha High School in Chandler, Arizona in 2017. Rated a 65-grade runner on the 20 to 80 scouting scale, according to MLB Pipeline. Point eight. Justin Steele, left-handed pitcher, impressive 53K 13 BB ratio in 2018 in his return to the mound after Tommy John surgery. 
was drafted three spots before Reese Hoskins in the fifth round of the 2014 draft. Point nine. Corey Abbott, right-handed pitcher in March 25, 2017, Abbott tossed the first perfect game in Loyola Marymount history, with 13 strikeouts and 106 pitches versus BYU.10. Keegan Thompson, right-handed pitcher Thompson is one of two right-handed pitchers named Thompson on this list, keep reading. And both have had Tommy John surgery.11, Zach Short, shortstop short finished second in the Southern League with 82 walks in 2018, behind another Zach Collins, who had 101. Of the four people in MLB history, with the last name Short, their average height is 6 foot. Zach is 5 foot 10.12. Alex Lang, right-handed pitcher Launch finished his career at LSU with 406 strikeouts, three behind all-time leader Scott Schultz. Pitched in the College World Series twice.13. Brendan Little, left-handed pitcher Little struck at 133 and 85 innings, 14.0K, 9 IP, in 2017 for the State College of Florida, Manatee, Sarasota. He is the Cubs' highest drafted pitcher under Theo Epstein and Jed Hoyer, 27th overall in 2017.14. Richard Gallardo, right-handed pitcher of Venezuelan-born right-hander, Gallardo is the youngest player on this list, born September 6, 2001.15. Nelson Velasquez, outfielder according to MLB Pipeline, Velasquez has the most raw power in Chicago's system. The Puerto Rico native finished season with Eugene Loe on a nine-game hitting streak, hitting .395.452.816 with four home runs and seven RBIs, two HR in his season finale, over that span.16. Giovanni Cruz, right-handed pitcher, six foot one righty, finished 2018 with a 0 0.75 era with 33 strikeouts and six walks in 24 innings over his last five starts, four in the Arizona League and one at Eugene. That low-A debut, where he had five scoreless innings with four hits, no walks and five strikeouts was on August 26, three days after his 19th birthday.17. Thomas Hatch, right-handed pitcher Hatch was the 2016 Big 12 Pitcher of the Year for Oklahoma State. He tossed three consecutive shutouts that year, April 22nd versus TCU, April 30th at Texas, May 6th versus Prairie View A. Paul Ridgen, right-handed pitcher The last three players the Cubs drafted out of the University of San Diego are Ridgen, second round 2018, right-handed pitcher Sean Barry, 21st round 2017, and Chris Bryant, second overall 2013. Had 31 strikeouts and just five walks in his first taste of pro ball with Eugene this past season. Ridgen attended Hart High School in Santa Clarita, Calif, same as Mike Montgomery and no. Five prospect Cole Roederer, Trevor Bauer and James Shields, 2.19. Tyson Miller, right-handed pitcher the 6-foot-5 righty, he's one of 14 right-handed pitchers in this top 30 list, it is the highest ever draft pick out of California Baptist University in Riverside, Calif. The Cubs drafted Miller in the fourth round in 2016. He led the Carolina League with 126 strikeouts for Myrtle Beach in 2018.20. Trent Jombroni, second base, shortstop the oldest player on this list, he turned 25 on December 20th. Had a 9-RBI game, with three home runs, a double and hit by pitch for AA Tennessee on July 5, 2018 at Jackson.21. Ravage Garcia, second base Eve Garcia formed a double play combo with Javier Baez, that would be interesting since Ravage is Javier backwards. It won't be anytime soon, according to MLB Pipeline, Garcia was the youngest position player to appear in the minors in 2018. The day he was born, August 12, 2001, the Cubs held Barry Bonds homerless, he had 50 at the time, as he was on his way to a record 73 that season. 22. Oscar De La Cruz, right-handed pitcher De La Cruz fell from number 1 in the Pipeline Cubs top 30 in 2017 to number 10 in 2018 to no. 22 in 2019. Injuries and command issues contributed to his slide down the list.23.
Jose Alberto's right-handed pitcher Alberto's was number two in the Cubs' 2017 top 30. What happened? A 14.84 era with 65 walks and 36 hits allowed in 30 and a third innings across two levels in 2018. However, he has struck out over a batter an inning at every level so far and he turns 21 in November, so there's time to work things out. 0.24. Dakota Mecca's right-handed pitcher the 6'7 righty has a 1.16 era in 147 career minor league innings, allowing only 87 hits while striking out 190. The 67 walks, 4.1 per 9 innings, to go along with that is the biggest concern. 0.25. Dwayne Underwood Jr., right-handed pitcher the only player on this list with MLB experience. He made one start, his MLB debut on June 25, 2018. He became the first starting pitcher in Cubs history whose last name begins with the letter U. Also, he was born on the day Don Plesak recorded his lone career save as a Cub, July 20, 1994. So there's that, point two six. Christopher Morel, third base, shortstop the 19-year-old Dominican infielder is listed at 6 foot and 140 pounds. He'll almost certainly add to that frame, but what, if he didn't? Looking at weights listed at baseball-reference.com, the last Cub 140 pounds or less was the 5'6 hurler Bobby Shantz in 1964. Also notable are Johnny Evers of poetic fame, 5'9", 125 pounds, and 19th century pitcher Larry Corcoran, 5'3", 127 pounds, who tossed three no-hitters, 0.27. Riley Thompson, right-handed pitcher Thompson had Tommy John surgery the day before he was drafted by the Reds in the 37th round of the 2015 MLB draft. He was also drafted by the Yankees in the 25th round in 2017 and was finally drafted by the Cubs in the 11th round in 2018 out of the University of Louisville. He has hit 100 miles per hour with his fastball.28. Luis Verdugo, shortstop for second base signed for $1 million out of Mexico in 2017. The Cubs haven't had a Mexican-born position player since Hector Torres appeared in 31 games for the Northsiders in 1971. Verdugo is one of three Mexican-born prospects on this list with Garcia and Alberto's .29. Johnny Parada, catcher in 2003, Johnny Peralta became the first Johnny in MLB history. Who knew he would eventually be followed by Johnny Nunez of the White Sox in 2009 and even Jonathan Solano of the Nationals in 2012. Anyway, Pareto was the Cubs minor league player of the month in May, hitting .287, .386, .460 with three home runs and 16 RBIs in 23 games for Myrtle Beach over that span. .30. Andy Weber, shortstop per second base played collegiate ball at Virginia. His Virginia bio page mentions that in 2016, he had three hits against James Madison, March 22, and that he scored two runs and drove in two against George Washington, April 6. Why he had such a grudge against former U.S. presidents is beyond me. Click here to download the new My Teams app by NBC Sports. Receive comprehensive coverage of your teams and stream the Cubs easily on your device.